Right guys, so it is Brentford at home today. Of course, Brentford have only just got promoted and they've played their first two games and obviously not lost the game yet. And today I'm really not too confident. I don't know what it is, but Brentford have got a lot of momentum. The lineup's out and I'm not 100% sure on it. Now in the game, we've got Ashley Young playing left mid. We've got no Mings and... Um, I've got a bad feeling about today, to be honest. Even if we do lose today, I'm not too bothered because we're back at Villa Park again for two weeks in a row. And that's all that really matters because obviously the atmosphere should be really good. But Dean Smith, Ollie Watkins, Ezri Konza all playing against the former team Brentford. So let's just see what happens today. Realistically, we should be winning and I probably should be a bit more confident. But today, I've just got a bad feeling. But uh, come on, the boys. Okay, just about to walk in the ground now. Kickoff is literally like two minutes. We're a bit late today, but we should make it in time. Chance there, I'm not too sure he's missed again. 33 minutes into the game, Brentford are going into the game a little bit. Their press is really, really good and really, really fast. And when they get the ball, they move it really quickly. They've had one chance there, another chance a few minutes ago where they probably should have scored. We're playing okay, we're getting the ball down, but we're not really doing anything in the final third. So. <laughs> Granddad's not been the best first half really, but what do you think? Frustrating game, isn't it? When they scored Brentford, I thought, oh, we could be getting into trouble here. Yeah. But we played well, we passed more. But we're so slow and deliberate with the builder. We need to move so much quicker. Yeah. When the ball comes to a play, it should be one look and move. Yeah. We need to sharpen up in the second half. We can win this game for sure. Just need to get quicker. What do you think, Tay? This half has been very interesting with those quick goals. Uh, we had a lot of chances. They found a lot of chances. They could have scored easily. Yeah. But so we need to work on our defence. So hopefully we score. Up the villa. Watkins on the bench, we saw warming up. Do you think he'll come on? Do you, what do you think? Do you think we should stick with Ings? 
two different types of players, aren't they? I think this is a game where he's just got three defenders on him. Yeah. He needs to hold the ball up. And he can't do that. He wants to play right. Yeah. I put wing, I put Ings out to the right. Yeah. And yeah. then I put Watkins in the middle. And let them play together and see how it works. bad in the second half either. Just went for the came there, played for a draw, fouling, wasting time. And we need to find the goal. Their defence is very good. Come on. Come on! Oh. Come on, we're playing so much better now. We've got the momentum. What a, what a surprise. What a surprise. The fans have been calling for him the whole game. Watkins is coming on. The fans have been calling for his name the whole match, so hopefully he can score for more. Get the box for fuck's sake! Wow, what a frustrating game. Aston Villa won, Brentford won. First half was a very meh game. Brentford got the ball down. They played really fast football. They were really good defensively. And overall, they were definitely the better team. And in the second half, they were time-wasting, fouling, going down injured like five or six times, which was so, so frustrating. They came and they played for a draw in the second half, which which is what teams like Brentford will do. It's what you expect. But um, I, we haven't watched it in person for over a year now so it's so weird to see again but that was uh, obviously really frustrating but in the second half was a very positive performance we played very very well Probably unlucky not to get a goal in the second half. Um, a draw was probably the fair result. Amy Buendia, what a player. In the first half, we had, what, maybe two shots, one of them being that goal, and he just got the ball and went, screw it, let's hit it, and what a finish it was. Really did play well. El Ghazi played well in the second half. Cash today, I thought, was awesome, was all over the pitch. And, yeah, hope you guys enjoyed. If we can get 150 likes, that would be amazing. Probably unlucky not to get the wins today, but the draw was probably deserved. And uh, up the villa, and screw you, Brentford, because you were... Horrible to watch.